Okay, another series I really like from uh, side mount. Again, always looking to control the limbs and getting rid of that elbow. And, and another way to get rid of that elbow, a little more advanced, is if he gets that elbow in, I'll post, pick my knee up, cut it through, step, and I'll windshield wipe either leg depending on my technique. So from here, maybe I'm going for those chokes and I'm not getting the reaction I'm, I'm looking for. Something I like to do is I'm gonna post and I'm gonna slide my knee up to like his belly and my foot steps on the bicep. When I step on the bicep, I'm kind of pulling this arm up, sliding my knee through, right into that area, and finishing the arm lock. Again, if he, if he tries to do that back right shoulder roll, I'm kind of ready for it. I'm gonna land right into that umaplata. Again, isolating, he gets that elbow in. Another way to pin that arm down is just using my legs, using my feet like hands. I'm looking to attack, I'm not getting it. I'm gonna step on the bicep as I'm stretching this arm up. My knee's coming over and under that armpit. I'm trying to catch that hand and finish the arm bar. From here, he gets that elbow in. I'm coming through, cutting, stepping, windshield wiping, looking to pull him up to his side. I look to catch this huggy here. He's gonna rotate, keep that elbow high so he can't grab anything. He still might be able to grab his leg. Switch my grips. Lock my kimura, stepping over, using that knee to keep him on his side. And I like to keep this knee on the bicep so he can't use it to really help. Again, I'm looking to put that behind him. If he's got a good grip, I'll give a couple snags this way and then I'll come back the opposite direction. Keep it high, go kimura, or rotate for the straight arm. Elbow comes in, I'll pop, cut, step, windshield wipe, pulling up, looking to catch that. Switch my grip, knee behind the back, try to go kimura. If I can't take it this way, grip will break that way, high, put it behind his back, or I can rotate to the straight arm. So again, he gets that elbow in, I pop, cut, step, windshield wipe, Looking to catch this arm, he bends it, switch, looking for my Kimura. Sometimes I can't break that grip. If I can't break that grip, what I'll do is I'll hold his wrist here, keeping him honest, and I'll open. Flap, pants, belt, whatever it is, and I get this palm up grip, that secures his hand in there. From here, I'm gonna switch my knees. This hand snakes behind. I'm going four fingers in the collar. If he stays down, I scoot away, and I suck him back using my shoulder to push his head forward, and he's gonna tap. If he starts to turn to his side, I hook the arm, and I'm gonna do a kind of a roll forward. Hook the leg, or the arm, and finish the choke here. Again, elbow in, pop, cut, step, windshield wipe. Looking to attack this arm, he rotates. I switch to my Kimura grip, trying to get the Kimura. I can't break the grip. He wants his arm more than I do. Switch this grip, palm up. Now as I switch my knees, my hand snakes behind the head and around the neck. I'm in the collar. I want to put him flat on his back, scooting away, and then I drag him towards me, pulling on the collar and using my shoulder to push his head forward. If he turns, I can start to Hook the arm and go to the back. I just pull him right back into my lap. Finish here too. 